Welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. This is Alan Paul. We're going to continue our Iron Man challenge today. This is going to be episode three. We are going to be continuing in the direction that we were headed in earlier. I believe it's going in a southerly direction this time. Um, again, we have our HUD on, not off. It's on, but we have the permadeath settings set to extreme. We have not used our starter ship, and we're going to see if we can't find a ship or that is find a crash ship and try to repair it or find a platform where we can purchase one which means acquiring materials on the way so here we go we are on this planet here nice cold place that we're on here we can't get into this facility oh yes we can we did get into this facility that's right so we're going to go ahead and sit in here remember we had turned off the uh, sentinels at that one point so we were able to get in here without anybody bothering us isn't that nice uh, so we have a couple items in the inventory. We don't have a lot of money in here, but if we can keep going with these stacks, that'll be great. These aren't worth as much, and neither are these. So if we can keep going with the salvage data, that's what we're going to go with. We're going to hang on to them for now until we need them. We're going to hang on to the microprocessor in case we need that to repair something later on, but we'll see. I'm going to keep some ammunition because now in my multi-tool, of course, I do have a... Uh, uh, or is it there it is a bolt caster in here so you know that's going to be handy in case we really 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 need it so let's keep a look look out we got one supercharged slot on this multi-tool that we acquired so we're going to keep our eye out see if we can't find anything along the way so let's head in that southerly direction that is going to be that way and see what we can find now this planet has dioxide on it which is good for life support so we're going to keep our eye open some of that. Maybe have may want to try to acquire some into one of our inventory slots. So let's get a move on. Here we go. Southerly we go. We'll keep an eye open for any uh, creatures out there. Regular Sentinel drones. Nothing special. Anybody out there that uh, might have something for us. Looks like we have another. Well, that's just a antique plaque. We don't need that. Oh yeah, dioxide, right? I was going to look for that. There's some over there. Copper and more dioxide over there. Actually, that one's closer. Let's go to that one. I almost was going to jet back over, but I'm going to run for a little further. Okay, there we go. We don't have any... Ooh, wow, what the heck happened? I bounced. Plenty of oxygen. Just want to make sure I didn't get any damage on here. Oh, okay. That was weird. All right. There it is. Dioxide deposit. So this may work in lieu of life support gels. And if that's the case, then we are in excellent condition because we just have to run across these once in a while and we'll be in good shape. Let me try to gather up about 300 of this. We're going to use a battery to get our hazard protection going. Nice. Okay. We've reached the bottom of it. I want to recharge that right away because otherwise it will drop like a rock and we'll have to use two of them. Don't want to do that. Alright, how much do we got of that stuff? 292. That should be 300 right on the, right on the money. South we go. Let's go. Ah, come on. Get up the ridge. Thank you. Okay. So again, we need to look for something. Watch out for the whip. Let's see what our life support does. I'm going to charge that back up. Life support? There we go. Look at that. 19 dioxide. We'll hang on to the life support gel for now. In case we need it. 
Ah, setting out 8,000 units. That's nice. All right, so what we want to try to do, we're going to gather up more of these as we can. As we go. Uh, we already know that's an ancient plaque, so we're not heading in that direction. We also want to check out any... Uh, We'll not only get a better buried technology, but if there's any damaged machinery there, we're looking for some sort of uh, uh, well thermal protection. That's what we need. We need we need a shield. And the only way we're going to find some is if we find some damaged machinery. So, okay, just making sure there's nothing I'm missing. It's funny because after I get done with a no HUD challenge, I. Realize how much simpler it is to do it this way. Oh, is that a cave? Let's do the cave real quick. For that main reason. Isn't that pretty? It's almost like a starry sky, even though it's just a bunch of plants. Very nice. Very nice. Do we have any cobalt on us, by the way? We are cobaltless. So we can get ourselves a couple more batteries and carry up to 60 of those. Uh, there we go. Yeah, we're gonna get copper out of this. Not that we need it, but... And tritium out of that one. Not that we need that. I expected that. That's okay. Just after the, after the cobalt for now. Once we get the cobalt, we'll... Call it here. Hmm, I can't even get rid of that. Okay, so we're going to get rid of that. Hmm, now it worked, right? Yeah. Let's get some more batteries, shall we? There we go. And that'll, that'll do for now. Let's put you up here just to get you out of the way. That'll give us three slots open right now. So we're in good shape. All right. Let's continue on. Where's our buried technology over there? Funny, it's about 44 units away, and we are literally right here by it. I wonder, will second person do to gather it? No? I was just curious. Um, oh great. Get out of second person. I just realized I think we have accidentally... There we go. Okay. No, we're back. We're still in the cave. Holy mackerel. There's an extensive cave system they have here. I'll take a look. I am curious. If I ran into a dwarf down here, I would be shocked. Okay, I think we're full circle. There we go. Bye, guys. Have fun storming the castle. And there we go. Hey, how many did we end up with? Good. And... There we go. All right. Okay, let's we'll stick to the mining beam for now. All right, souther, 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 southerly. This way. Okay. Getting as far away from everything as we can. That is the one thing I do not miss when doing the HUD no HUD challenges. Not listening to her. Like, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Alright, we've got two back to back up there. That's not bad, but I'm gonna hit this one over here because it's near the damaged machinery. And it's very close. And as we get to the very technology, it should turn blue on our scope. There it is. And we should get closer. We should be able to pick it up, maybe? Yes? No? Yes? No? No, not, not this time, huh? Oh, that one's pretty far down there. That's probably why. Now, I did hear the ships go over. That's a bird. Great. Where'd they go? There they went. They're going in the opposite direction, so that's not going to help me any.
Launch fuel. Yay. Okay. Moving on. South we go. Uh, let's see. We got a salt deposit. Let's go... I'm going to skip that one. That's not quite in our general range. It's Actually, it is in our in our range. Let's go to that one. Maybe there'll be some buried... Not buried technology. Some more units. Uh, what do you call it? Those stupid things. Damage machinery. Yes, that's what it's called. Words. Use words. Yes. There we go. <laughs> well, in case you all didn't weren't aware of this, I live in this lovely state of Kentucky, and in this wonderful state of Kentucky, we happen to have spring, and with spring comes allergies. With allergies comes coughing and sneezing and everything else under the sun, so don't be surprised if you hear some noise in the background from some of the kids. But since most of you already know, I have kids... It's not surprising. Why am I not able to pick anything up anymore? Did they fix that? That would stink. Now, where'd it go? There it is. I hope it hasn't stopped working. That would really, really stink. Hello? Hello? One ship. Hmm, what that? Ugh. Useless. Don't bother getting that stuff. Oh, there's another thing I need. I need a charge for my uh, backpack. My jetpack. Oh, yeah. Some kind of upgrade for that, too, while I'm at it. So we have a lot of oxygen on us, but we have dioxide. See, look at that. All right, let's take a peek, shall we? Uh, let's go to that one, I guess. Straight in front of me, and we look around for any buildings. And just so you know, my thermal protection is falling, in case you were unaware. So what you say to yourself? Is your thermal protection falling? Nope, you don't have to wonder at all. Because of course it is. There is a lot of ships flying over. There they go again. This time we're going to watch them. I don't know how far we'll be able to see them. Oh yeah, yeah, let's get all these rocks and trees in my way. They're going to the right. And they're going out that way. So it's going to be that way. We're heading in the right direction. That's good. Okay. And I think we got some damaged machinery right in front of me. How about an upgrade, my friend? From inside the rock. More nanites. Thank you very much. Or did I? Yep, looks like more nanites. All right, let's try this again. Uh, where'd it go? There, there you... Wow, I think I got it this time. That felt stupid. Sorry about that. Next stage. Uh, let's see. Nothing. Let's just head that direction and keep going. And... Oof, there we go. Boy, yeah. Really need an upgrade for that jetpack. But I still would rather have a hazard shield. Okay, let's see. Ain't nothing out there. Well, it sounds like we got more ships flying over. Son of a gun. 
Well, we're never going to see where he's going. He's too far out there, so. Hey, guess what? My thermal protection's falling. So, let's get up to the top of the hill here. I mean, it's only 73 degrees below zero. Come on. It's really not that cold. How are we doing on dihydrogen? I'm going to go ahead and gather some of this up because I could always use some. I just want to have enough in my inventory in case I need it. There we go. That's good. Well, there's more of it here, huh? All right. Wow. That dude was fast. I wonder if he had landed behind me and I didn't even see him. That stinks if he did. Because usually the landed ships, they take off a little quicker. Oh, come on. Get up the slope already. Ugh. Horrible. Ugh. <sighs> I wasn't trying to do that. Nope, not yet. It's weird. Must have hit it earlier. Okay, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. There we go. All right. Let's take a closer look from up here. Or a longer look? I don't know how you want to put that. Do we have more ships flying overhead? This is a busy planet. All right, so now they're headed in that general direction. Use the sodium that time. Sorry, I didn't realize it was getting so low. You'd think I would pay attention to her by now. Uh, they are strictly going straight down. They're not going in a direction left or right. So heading just to the right of due south is the direction we want to go in. And they're going straight up. It should be in that direction. That is the game plan. Hey, that was rude. Ooh, blocked. All right, let's see here. Kablam. Now, it would be nice to find myself a nice crashed ship, but... It will show up on my radar. Okay, we're going to try to get up to the top of that thing. Right about over there. Okay. Oh, I skipped. Hey, look, very technology. Hey, we can grab it that time. Okay. All right, so they're kind of headed in that direction. I expect them to turn left, but I don't think we're going to see them. Yeah, they're out of eyesight now. Oh, wait a minute. Yep, see, they do go a little bit to the left. So, yeah, that's the direction we want to go in. Ooh, I've got a good feeling about this. How far How far are we in? 20 minutes. Okay, we're 20 minutes in. Guess what? Thermal detection is falling, in case you were unaware. Uh, I think I'll skip those this time. But we still need buried technology. 
We need a lot of it, because I just have a funny feeling we're going to run across something. And we're not going to have enough resources to buy it. That was a cave, I know. I'm going to skip it this time. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't be surprised if something got damaged, honestly, at this point. Oh. See? See? That's what I'm talking about. What is it going to require? A wiring loom that I don't have. A bugnium I don't have. No, that's useless to me now. Oh. Gotcha. So, so much for that, huh? Crying out loud. Stupid whips. So now I gotta take on a sentinel in order to get what I want. Wiring loom is a whole nother ball of wax, though. I probably won't be able to get a wiring loom from anywhere. Unless I can find a minor trading post or something like that. Or, you know, a platform, in which case they're probably gonna have wiring looms. Ugh. So now my life support's gonna drop even quicker. And my... Hazard protection... Is falling. All right, get over here. Nope, not going to do it. There. What I tell you. What did I tell you? Was I right or was I right? I told you to head in the southerly direction and you were going to find something. Every time it works. Okay, so now what we need to do is we need to find more of that. So, let's get it. We found ourselves an archive. We can now buy ourselves a ship. We just don't have the money to buy one yet. Why... Does it show I'm paired up with someone named Eldritch? My network should be off. It's disabled. Somehow I must have done that at another time. That is really, really strange. Okay. Sorry, I don't know who you were, Eldritch. If you are watching this video later, very sorry about that. You know what, uh, know what else I need to do? Just to play it safe? I better check my PvP settings. Because... Yeah. There we go. Okay, I don't mind that. But no. <laughs> Sorry, Eldritch. <laughs> Because he could have found me and started shooting at me and taking me out. Because that could have been the end of the episode right there. Alright. So how much money do we have? 900 units. We have nowhere near enough to get what we need. Okay, but that's okay. That's okay. We're going to keep going here. For a little bit. Um, the hardest part to do here is to be able to keep track of... Um, where the building is located. Here, there's another one right there. Let's go ahead and grab that. Did I see? There's an unknown building down there. Let's take a look at that, too, because if it turns out to be something, you know? There we go. 
it turns out to be a crashed ship right next to this archive, well, you know, something else we could have done here. So while the episode isn't over... Oh, you're a jerk. <laughs> I'm sorry. Let's go ahead and get rid of some stuff here. I don't need that. Um, I kind of don't need that right now. Let's use you right here. Really? One? Where'd that building go? It should be right over here. Okay. Ugh, oh, for Pete's sake. Anything break? No? Okay. We're gonna go ahead and use it now. Sorry. Now we have an open slot. Okay, good. What did I get hit by? Oh, man. Man, I hope I don't die before all of this is over. Eh. Yeah. Watch it be a, um... Now, just one of those, but I could use the items that are there. Ugh. Let's just see if there's anything in there. Scanner module. Yay. But you know, actually it is handy. To be honest. Because it will give us... Fauna and minerals. So not the flora, so not the plants, but the animals and any minerals I scan will give us extra cash. So that's okay. Let's go ahead and save this here. That's way if we glitch out or something like that. We have something to go back to. Okay. Alright, and is there an item here? There's you. You know what? We could really use you, buddy. Come on. Thank you. How many are we up to? Let's get rid of you. Alright, I think it's time to... Get over to the archives. Let's still let's sell some of the stuff off of our person while we're here. Forty-five thousand. Seventy-two thousand. How many are there? There's only six on the planet, so I'm only going to get enough for six. But you know, it is what it is. Forty-five, and I don't see anything else around me, but it's not really important right now, because there's not enough animals really to make a whole lot, but I stay. Hey, it's a couple hundred thousand, you know? All right, let's get back over to the, ooh, yeah, back to third person. That first person kind of makes me a little nauseous there. Watch this. Fifteen grand for a rock. <laughs> Wish I could do that in real life. You can't use fifteen grand from a rock. See what I mean? Awesomeness. Alright. Let's head over there. I realize my thermal protection is falling. Yet again. Well, this has been a good night for me, man. So, my other permadeath challenge... Is going to be a surprise for you folks, but finally, 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 finally. Hey, isn't that nice? Telling us we're good people for making money. That's awesome. There we go. Another thing on fire over here. Hey. Let's grab this while we're here. There we go. And it looks like it only gave us two that time. Alright. It'd be great if you could give me some hazard protection. Starship shield. 
Awesome. Very glad for that. All right, we should be able to make it to the archives here on what we've got. All right, I need a stairwell. I guess that's the closest. Ah, uh, there's one. I think. Uh, at least we got some interiors we can run into. So we can set up base here if we want to. Alright, up we go. And we should start recovering right here. There we go. Okay, good deal. I don't know what it is about this spot at these archives, but for some reason this is a good spot to stand. So, we have no ships here, yet. There's one landing right now. Let's take a quick peek and see what we're looking at as far as charges are concerned. 14 million. Uh, yeah, I can't afford that. How about you? What are you at? Eight. Okay, that's a little better. And how about you? You look like a piece of crap. How much are you? Fifteen. <laughs> Very expensive piece of crap, apparently. And you're probably more expensive. Eleven, yeah. Alright, let's trade. Uh, let's see. Album and Pearls are gone. Gek, Corvax. Uh, what do we got here? Hard frame. Salvage data gives us a lot. Let's get rid of the microprocessor. And I think that should be it. Okay. No, you got nothing I want. So, 2.6 million. We obviously need a lot more money. So, it is time to do a little bit of searching. So, let's take a quick peek around. We're going to look for whatever we can find at this point. Um, we could... Copper's really not worth that much. So, going after copper is probably not going to help us at all. Uh, would love to find more um, very technology. So heading in that direction, which is the direction we did not come from, is probably the way to go. Now, what we're looking for, too, is we're looking for the cheapest ship we can find. Wrong button. We need to know if there's a ship in here for like four million or something like that. In one episode, I found one for three and a half. It's not often, but usually the cheapest one I found is about five mil. Ooh, that's pretty. But probably very expensive. Yeah, 41. Yeah, the explorers are pretty expensive sometimes. Should be a platform over here. Looks like there's a ship on it. 11 million for that anvil of beauty, which is, if you want to call it that, that is completely up to you, and I will not argue, sir. Uh, I don't know if there's another platform out here someplace. I don't think there is. I think that's all of them. Oh, I thank you. All right. Well, that's good to know. Good to know. All right, so we know where we're going to head. Ah, what do you know, traveler? Yeah. Interesting. All right, so we don't want to sell anything. I just want to see what happens to be for see what happens to be here. Okay. Interesting. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head in this general direction. Uh, what time is it? We're at the thirty-five minute mark. We're actually five minutes past. So I am going to get to the protected area right here, and. We're going to get a screenshot uh, right after I take a look at the ship. Screenshot of where we are. If we shall. There we go. Let's go over here. And there we go. And we're going to title this, I Made It. Almost. So the next episode, you're going to see me gathering up some materials, and it's going to be kind of boring. If you want to watch the grind, you can watch it, but you can probably skip to the end where we actually purchase the ship. So, thanks for watching. Please hit that like, like and subscribe buttons at the bottom, and we really appreciate you watching, folks. Take care. We'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.